both of y'all. I push back is where, who's calling? Oh, Freddie T, who's calling? RC's hit me, no big deal. Who's calling? Janice, Jeanette, Tammy, this. To y'all, I think it would be more of a rise if I say RC or Freddie T, and then if I say, say, Linda. Because you y'all will look at a women friend different than you look at Freddie T's hit me. Me and Freddie well, T about going think, golfing. I think, I think me and RC's is, talking about hey, what where we working later. I think I think that's the point of it's the, the it's conversation. The, it's also though I think it's also the perspective in which you present the relationship, right? If Joy or Taylor meet me and I have this certain friend who I've had for a long time, they understand our relationship, then they're not going to get a rise out of it because they're going to meet that person in that manner. Mm -hmm. And they're going to understand and I'm going to make it clear that this is the relationship that we have. Now, if Linda is new, it's like, we got to meet Linda. Yeah, and that, right? yeah. Like, and, and, so, and so, like, I understand that. And also, I truly do understand the part about just learning and understanding to respect women as a whole. Now, I will say this as well, and because I want to move on and have like a different conversation, <laughs> because I'm sure you guys have had that conversation, yeah. like where you'd be like, hey, you know, all the baddies feel this way. I've learned as I've gotten older and you move into a world with more confident women, you move into a world with more assertive women. Sometimes it's not necessarily us feeling like we can't have these relationships because we can't control ourselves. It's having been in enough conversation or been, in, been around enough people where they throw the hints out that, oh, this could be something more, or I do see you in a different way, or they start to come to you and behave differently. Like it's not just men who sometimes can't control themselves around women. It's certain men that women feel a certain way about too. For sure. You and, know, so. and I think the overall overarching point of the conversation, which was a little lost in all of the comments and retorts, is... It's about respect. It's about respect, but also it's who are these people to you? I, I, I'm not suggesting that my man go just make a bunch of new female yeah, friends. Yeah, that'd be insane. Is this <laughs> someone that you've known since high school that you know their husbands and you like you've met their kids and okay like this is so and so that i've known for 15 years we're cool i'm not sleeping with her yeah. they're very obviously interested in who he is as a person yeah. they've seen him in different versions and are happy for him like there's an energy that you can feel around these people of course women want men and sometimes present as friends in order to yeah. get with them as well people like to have sex with each other. That is the world it's that it's we it's live an adult in. Thing. Yeah. What we're talking about is if I meet a man and he has no interest in women other than sex, which he will make known very early because of his friend group, of how he talks to women, how he talks to me, that is alarming to me. And I'm just saying, I don't want that. And that's, that's yeah. your choice, though. That yeah. is your choice. You're right. entitled. Yeah, which and you're is entitled key. to And when meditation. I say all the baddies, yeah. to be clear, because every time anyone makes a sweeping generalization, everyone gets mad, I'm talking about all my baddies. There are other baddies <laughs> that I'm sure disagree. But also, too, and very importantly, is we are also speaking from experience. experience. Like, I am in a very loving, happy, healthy relationship with a man who is the best, who has female friends that I do not care about. So to ask about, okay, the pe yeah. person calling, no, I, I live this, it does not matter to me. Yeah. There is a, a trust that exists, there is a belief in how he values what women are. And above all else, relationships are contracts. You determine the terms of your contract. As long as that person is not breaking those terms in your contract, then you're good. No. The, the disrespect comes from when you have decided to go out of bounds of what has already been discussed and agreed upon. And no person should do that in any relationship. And again, if you do not want your man to have female friends, that's good for you. We're not trying to change your mind. We're just talking about our experiences and the life that we've lived. And actually, I, I want to I put the, the final pin on it. Don't, don't take my advice. You don't live the life I live. These are, we have different problems. I say this all the time when people ask me questions. We don't have the same problems, baby. I live a different life than you do. You should not just blanketly take my advice if what I do does not apply to your lifestyle. Taylor and I are outside. We are traveling the world. We are around and in different rooms around different people. We are constantly around men. That might not at all be what your man can deal with. And that's okay because he's your man. Your man doesn't have to worry yeah, about me. Think, he's not my man. I think that's the point though too though. 
you don't start these shows to necessarily give advice. You're starting right. these oh, shows. Oh, that, that wasn't at all what we're and doing. You're, and, you're sharing, <laughs> and you're sharing your experiences. I think what happens is in our lines of work, on, on speak, as you continue to work in the many realms you work, you got like you got jobs like me, right? <laughs> when when you do that, we are thought to be the experts. We are thought to be knowledgeable on something and sharing that knowledge in hopes that people learn from it. Because that is the job we're paid to do from a media standpoint. When you start a show like that and you decide, okay, we're gonna share our true thoughts, we're gonna be open, people are viewing it from what your linear network job is as that's opposed a, that's to, 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 to which you is, which is Fred's question yeah, yeah as opposed to you guys sitting down and just talking